All right, so we're doing a uh, what a burger mukbang because Zaxby's would not let us uh, order from them because they're stupid. So uh, as much as we appreciate the chicken from Zaxby's, they decided they would not like our business today because they made their ordering process too complicated and they closed and wouldn't let us order. So uh, buffalo chicken... Buffalo chicken ranch, maybe? Buffalo chicken salad from Whataburger. Um, I don't think I've had one of the salads from Whataburger before. So this is kind of interesting. The chicken looks good. Um, they got a bunch of blue cheese on this. And uh, Whataburger is really fucking good. Like, I've been happy with every time we've ordered them. I have been very happy. Um, and so we made sure to order some uh, things that we consistently enjoyed before. Um, honey barbecue chicken strip sandwich is something we've had before and have enjoyed very much. Spicy chicken sandwich, that is something I have not had before. And then this just says special, which I maybe I'll have to remember what this... Oh, yeah, this is the um, Buffalo Ranch limited time chicken sandwich uh, that we have had before and we decided was so fucking good that we're going to get it again. So, so the chicken sandwiches at, at Whataburger, they're huge and they're like, they're fucking crispy as shit. Like the chicken that they put in here, like I don't know what they do to it. But... Got a piece of onion. Mmm. Like the breading is still, it's got like a good crunch to it. You know? Mmm. The bun, especially, I'm glad that I had, uh, like Wendy's and Burger King recently because now I'm able to to pick out all these tiny differences in terms of like the quality of the um the burger. Mm. The bun is a billion times better. It's not like a sad but even if it gets swish, squished it's not like sad. Mm. Buffalo sauce, the ranch sauce, perfect fucking combo. It's amazing. I know Cat BF likes this one. Saving most of it for him. There we go. Um, oh, it's fucking incredible. I have never been disappointed with Whataburger. They're like... The most disappointing thing on their menu was the, uh, like, avocado something, bacon avocado burger, which was just like, eh, whatever. But every single other thing that I've had from Whataburger is, like, fucking incredible. I think this is, like, my favorite fast food burger place, period, at this point. All right, so this is the spicy chicken sandwich. Uh... peek inside uh let's see what this is like so i don't think i've had this before this is just literally just regular spicy chicken sandwich mm. i like that so as a person that has had now what like four different spicy chicken sandwiches over the past week from different various fast food places I like that the spice isn't the exact same between restaurants. Um, 
This is one where it's clear that the spice is in the actual chicken and batter. Like how they like fry the chicken. There's like a spicy batter to it. Mmm, it's good. Damn, that's a very neutral spice, which is good. You get to like taste the rest of it like kind of uninhibited uh, without like overwhelming the rest of the flavor of like what would just be the original non-spicy version. You kind of just get to taste a spicier version of the original chicken sandwich. Mmm. It was good. You know, um, well, first we're just doing a fucking mukbang. We're talking about the food. And then I can put on something if you want. But... That uh, buffalo ranch is delicious. You were correct. Mm-hmm. This is not a bad neutral like spicy chicken sandwich, but it would not rank among the top ones I've had this week. Okay. I would say the one that you're eating is incredible. The fucking Buffalo Ranch. They should just add it to their regular menu. I'm sad that it's a limited time thing. I don't know why it's a limited time thing. Yeah. So good. I'm going to steal one more bite of that in a bit. Um, and then, uh, yeah, the regular just spicy chicken sandwich or whatever, like, it's good. But after having, like, I don't know, like, the Wendy's one was probably better. And then what else did I have? Oh, my God. So this is the, uh, fuck, what is it called? What is this thing? It's like mm-hmm. maple something. It's like on Texas toast. It's chicken, chicken strips and what is it? Avocado? It's not the avocado one. We didn't like the avocado one. I'll go back to their menu. It is the honey barbecue chicken strip sandwich. Oh. And I remember liking this one a lot. So this is some monstrosity on Texas toast. Why do they call it Texas toast? It's not the only restaurant that does it. Why do they do that? Because it's big, like Texas. It's a regular size piece of toast. <laughs> They make toast. It's a thick this, piece of toast because it's Texas I think it's size. the same size as what you would get in the grocery store. It's just toast. I don't know why they call it Texas toast. Not it's thick. a big sandwich, though. Mm-hmm. You know what? I think you're right. I think it is bigger. It's thick. Like Texas. I think it's more surface area. I think it's a wider... It's a uh, larger... Square centimeter, or sorry, let's say square inch for the Americans. Mm-hmm. Piece of toast. Mm. I love how even when it's wrapped up, the batter never gets like soggy on the chicken. There's always this like satisfying texture to it. Yeah, they figured something crunch. out. Mm. That's dope. All right. I will save most of these sandwiches for later. Is this the... uh... Mm -hmm. Buffalo Ranch is the best out of those three. Why is it limited time? Why? Why do you have to limit my time on this planet? And then... uh, 
something that I guess I should finish tonight because it won't last as well for leftovers is the salad, which I haven't tried yet. It's got a huge amount of chicken in there. It's got some bacon. Holy shit. Some cherry tomatoes. A fuck ton of blue cheese. What the fuck? And then there's ranch dressing on the side, which I'm, I guess I'm supposed to put on it, but I'll try not to go overboard. Right, there's a lot of dranch, dranch resting left. So there's a lot of dranch resting. Mm. It's not bad. The quality of the actual greens is like mid. Oh, this chicken's great. More of that uh, same buffalo ranch, some blue cheese. And then I guess just added bacon, but um, I will say from memory, mm -hmm. Zaxby's had the better salad. I'd believe it. I remember that was like a fucking dope salad. I will have to put this in the fridge. There's no way I can fucking eat the rest of this right now. Yeah, I'm full. That's a lot of blue cheese. Holy shit. Why? America. Gotta love the excess. Mm. All right, I'm done. Wow. Yeah, I guess. Uh, how do I rate this? Um, salad, six out of ten. Uh, spicy chicken sandwich, like, what do I give it? It was fine, maybe 5.5 .5 out of 10. And then the, <clears throat> the honey barbecue chicken strip sandwich, 7 out of 10. That buffalo ranch chicken strip sandwich, which is unfortunately limited time, that's like an 8 out of 10. That was really good. Mm -hmm. That's that's a great flavor, great texture, great bun. The chicken's really really good. perfect. Them on the spice. It's like yeah, it's not. You don't feel like you're in a competition with the spice. It's like a and and the flavors of both sauces, the buffalo and the ranch are like perfectly complementary towards each other. Mm -hmm. mm. Delicious, good stuff. What a burger. Very, very dependable, very delicious, and uh, good portions for their meals. I'm going to have a bunch of leftovers, and I'm probably going to have one more bite of that sandwich, but yeah, delicious. Thank you. Do you have a, do you have a rating? For which one? Any of them. Uh, I don't know. Whatever I give it last time. I don't know. Buffalo chicken sandwich is pretty good. 
no real flaws. Nine, maybe ten. Uh, I didn't eat the honey barbecue one. The little chicken sandwich, the spicy one. Uh, I don't know. The solid six. That's all I ate really. I did not I stream myself doing my own quite songs full. on Beat Saber. Sorry, what'd you say? I'm quite full. Me too. All right, thank you. <laughs>